Goose Island, we pride ourselves not only in the incredible quality of our beer, but also in the unique stories behind them. It is these stories that really help set us apart from all the other craft breweries out there today. And very few American craft beers on the market have a richer story than Bourbon County Stout. Bourbon County Stout has the distinct honor of being the very first of its kind and thus creating and defining the style of bourbon barrel-aged beer, now a hugely popular category of beers. BCS was first created way back in 1992 as a commemorative beer to celebrate the 1,000th batch of beer ever brewed at our original brew pub. The idea came to our then brewmaster and son of the founder, Greg Hall, during a casual encounter with Jim Beam's master distiller's grandson, Fred Booker No. Greg wanted to know what was done with all the leftover bourbon barrels at the distillery, and Fred simply said that nothing was done with them, save that his grandma turned a few into flower pots. So then Greg simply asked if he could have a few barrels, and Fred obliged him by sending a few up to the brewery, and that's where history started. The original commemorative batch of beer, now known as Bourbon County Stout, was aged in those Jim Bean barrels for a mere three months. But now, as you can see, we're predominantly using Heaven Hill barrels and aging for much, much longer. We now let Bourbon County Stout age in bourbon barrels for over 10 months and sometimes up to 14 months to pick up all those nuances from the barrel, all those layers of flavor that come together to create wonderful Bourbon County Stout. So this is 2014's Bourbon County Stout. It pours an inky black, but with subtle chestnut, almost mahogany brown notes to it. Now the aroma, that's where it really comes into play. You've got all those nuances and subtleties that are given by the bourbon barrels. You've got toasted coconut, cherry, almost smoky, kind of leathery smells. The body is so rich and warming. And the flavors come together as, again, that, that toasted coconut and dark cherry are there. You get coffee and, and chocolate. There's so much complexity in this beer, it's hard to even put your finger on all the different flavors and aromas that you pick up. And while the occasions for which to best enjoy Bourbon County Stout are infinite, the temperature is really important. You want to serve Bourbon County Stout at cellar temperature, which is around 45 to 55 degrees. It's those warmer temperatures that allow all those nuances and complexities and aroma and flavor to come out. If it's too cold, you won't pick up on all the different layers of flavor that we work so hard to put into Bourbon County Stout. So as far as using Bourbon County Stout as an ingredient in a recipe, you can add it to cake mixes, all sorts of desserts, you can use it as a braising liquid. You can add it to mole sauces. The possibilities are infinite. I'm currently standing in and enjoying my Bourbon County Stout in Goose Island's new barrel aging facility that we call the Staviary. It currently holds around 6,000 barrels, both wine and bourbon, at over 130,000 square feet, allowing us to have the largest barrel aging program in the country.